Hey everybody, it's Level Up with Mitts. This is a quick video. I wanted to point out something which I think is pretty amazing. The company Watt Cycle. So this 100 amp hour battery, it's a 12 volt. I just picked it up, did a quick video on it. We did a capacity test and everything was fine. As you all know, if you're in the battery world or if you're in the solar world, Will is one of those premier people. He has a breakdown of batteries that you can't even touch. He's just phenomenal at what he does and he has a ton of information. So he put this up. 3,584, but the case says 3,840. That is wrong. What he ended up doing was taking the 300 amp hour battery, doing a full breakdown, doing a full capacity test, looking at the cells, doing the math, and found out it did not equate to the label on the battery. Just because it tests high on the first couple cycles does not mean you're allowed to label it like this. And at the voltage nominal of these cells, these are 280 amp hour cells, so this should be called 280 amp hours. Watt cycle, being a battery at an extremely good price, typically falls under the category of, eh, it is what it is. Well, not so. And this is where it gets interesting. Within 24 hours of that video being released, Watt Cycle did this. They posted a letter admitting they were wrong, admitting that they printed a label that didn't meet up to the specs. To me, that is more valuable in a company to admit they did something wrong and immediately go after what they did and correct it. They're going to print new labels. They're going to provide a discount. They're going to do whatever they can to make sure that the customer is happy. Show me another budget battery that's going to do it at that level. So just me diving into the batteries a little bit. I just found this extremely interesting and I'll tell you what, so far Watt Cycle has been one of the most responsive companies for the budget battery, but I don't even want to put it as a budget battery. It's a quality battery. It has decent components, it's designed well, the company backs it, and they're really pushing the limits of what these lithium iron phosphate batteries can do. Trolling motors, off grid, campers, you name it. If you have a need for a battery, I'll tell you what, I'll throw an affiliate link down below. It is absolutely worth checking out Watt Cycle. They have a ton of things on their website, and so far, everything they've done, I think, has been the right move. So let's see if it continues. We're going to start testing more of their batteries. Again, quick video from Level Up with Mitts. Just me backing up a company that did the right thing.